their impressions of Barbados uh, until you actually come back here and talk to the people and exist in the environment. You cannot get that from the news or you can't get that from uh, reading about stuff on the internet. Uh, you need to immerse yourself in it. I think you need to be here to see that uh, and see how, how you may fit in to the new society. We are still, I think, held back in, in some ways by old attitudes. Uh, and I think those, you know, those will naturally go away. Uh, and I think we have a more progressive, I see a young uh, professional class growing up here, which is uh, very progressive. Uh, in their thoughts and their attitudes and much more accepting of diversity and, and difference than anything that I, um, anything that I experienced you know, 45 years ago, 50 years ago when I was a kid here. Uh, so, but I, I, don't think you can, I don't think you can really sense that if you listen to the loudest, most strident voices, which is what you tend to see, hear in the newspapers on, and, and on social media you tend to get the extremes and that those people are not representative of the attitudes in general. I think and I think you need to be here to see that.